Daddy Seb, TV Seb, Bitch K. Honda CB754 first came out, shocked the world in 1969. This is a 1977 model. It was the second to last year, the single overhead cam, the traditional, original Honda CB750 engine. And what a beauty this is. This is an original paint survivor. It's got the original paint job, all original chrome, original seat. It was lovingly cared for by the original owner for many years, always stored indoors. And uh, just a beautiful piece. It's been up Mac 4 into 4 exhaust system on it. Has a super nice rumble to it. I wish it was nicer out, but it's December 16th, just nine days till Christmas, and it's freaking cold in Connecticut and snow. And we got the plows on the truck, and uh, we had some snow this morning. The roads are all icy, so there's no way I was taking this thing out into the salt. Um, just a beautiful piece. It's been uh, gone through mechanically and cosmetically here at Kaplan Cycles. It's got a, a new set of Dunlop tires on it. In fact, the rear tire, we just put that on uh, just the other day. It's got less than a mile on it. Uh, it's never been on the street, just dri driven in the museum here. Brand new Dunlop rear tire. Has original shocks on it, Origi like I said, original paint. No evidence of ever being dropped on, 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 uh, on the right side and the left side. Looks to be in mint condition also. Uh, no scratches on the uh, engine or, or the, uh, the, the ends of the the levers, these, these are the original grips, guys, from 1977, near as I can tell. They look like the original grips, original levers. Um, let's see if the, the mirrors may have been replaced, I'm not sure. But the original gauges on it are in nice, nice condition, have, still have a nice uh, shine on the glass. Sometimes they get like kind of a smoky, cracked look and whatnot, but uh, beautiful piece. Let me go over the work order with you and I'll let you know what we've done to it so far. Um, it was given a full rotisserie detail, it was steam cleaned, hand washed, polished, waxed, all the chrome was cleaned, all the aluminum was polished, uh, the chain was lubed, um, the seat was conditioned. They uh, actually, let's see, I don't, they touched up the frame and uh, the center stand and the kickstand that, that were repainted, but other than that, it's all original paint. The um, service department changed the oil, put a new oil filter in it. Uh, changed the points, put the new rear tire and tube on it, redid the rear brakes, put new rear brake shoes on it, uh, new plug wires, uh, new ignition switch. Uh, they did a major carb service on it, uh, removed the carbs, cleaned and rejetted them, then resync the carburetors, reset the mixture screws, uh, installed new points, set the gap, set the timing, did the engine oil service with, new, with the new oil filter, replaced the rear brake shoes, cleaned the rear drum, cleaned and lubed the brake cam, uh, new rear tire and tube, adjusted the chain, installed the custom, New black ignition wires. They uh, put new spark plugs in it and a new battery. So also a new headlight. Needed a new headlight too, the bulb was out. So, and new engine oil. So she's ready to go guys. Uh, didn't need that much work. Um, total in the, in the shop of, of 20 hours between the detailing and services plus the parts. Uh, the total came to $3,745 on the work order. And she's ready for uh, another 40 years. So, um, Love, love these original single overhead cams, real classic look, timeless design, and they're getting hard to find in, in good original condition. Original chrome on the wheels, original shocks, original chrome on the fenders, everything looks super clean on this thing. You just, original, original saddle is in mint condition. You know, to find a 45 year old motorcycle with the upholstery and chrome and paint that looks this nice is, 
find a, a, any any type of vehicle, let alone a motorcycle, in this kind of shape is it, it, they're hard to come by. So this is uh, definitely uh, one of my favorite classic motorcycles. This bike here has not only electric start, but kick start too. One of the last years when it came with a kicker. So if you kill the battery or if you, lift, you leave your lights on, if you look closely, it still has the original yellow uh, marking on the, on the foot peg bolt from the factory. The original, usually that stuff wears off. There's an indicate the bike hasn't, hasn't probably been power washed much, if, if at all. The original chrome on the um, engine cover here is, is really nice. Uh, the Chrome cover here is really nice. The, the aluminum polish, aluminum is really nice. The carbs look, look like new. Has a stock original air box. The only item that's not original on this bike is the four into two Mac performance exhaust. But um, the chrome, the fork lowers look really nice. The chrome on the front fender is in really good condition. The chrome on the fork slider is really nice. Uh, the headlight bucket's nice and straight. No evidence of any crash damage there. The original reflectors, like I said, um, they're getting to be super, super hard to find in this kind of condition. Um, we just sold a 77 750 Super Sport. Check under our completed listings. Just auctioned off for $8,500. They're, they're um, rock solid investment quality classics that are going up in value and they have that traditional Honda mechanical integrity. Here, here's the original um, frame sticker here. You can see that's still in really nice shape. It's a hallmark of a real nice bike. If you have any questions about it, give us a call, 860-454-7024. We can ship it anywhere in the USA for you. Um, we can help you with the financing. So it's nine days before Christmas. This will be listed. If you want to have it, we can have it under your tree. Just uh, give Junior a call, 860-454-7024. Thanks for watching. Happy holidays, everybody. God bless America.